Is there something there? No, because it comes up with like, um, thingy. I hate uh, Wait, what's there? that? Are there any instructions? Yeah. Oh, you found it. Should we do that? Yeah. Okay, we're going to do something one. Hello, everyone. Hello. We tweez it. Ah, you stabbed me with the Millennium Falcon, you bastard. Someone probably tweeted. Um, we've got, um, a thing here that's the build your own Millennium Falcon that Ruby wants to do when we do the podcast. Um, we don't know what to talk about. <laughs> no. Well, a lot of things. I, I'm gonna just. I saw Lego Movie too. That's amazing. Sure. Everything is still awesome. Um, I haven't seen it yet. I'm no. um, it. Frozen trailer. Yep. Super Bowl trailers that we still haven't talked about because we pre-recorded and Alita: Battle Angel. But first, Ruby, how are you? How was your week? Great. Great. Oh, great. Kind of just chill, you know. Already Friday tomorrow is kind of a few months. Which bit to start with? So you start with that bit? Yep, pop it out. Uh huh. Give it to me. Okay. Um, okay. So, what's going on in your life? Talking to the mic while I try and break this off and not stab myself? Nothing, really. It's Valentine's Day when I'm filming this. Yep. Yeah. I've got something. Do you? From what? Did you get a Valentine's Day present? Not from Mama, did you? <laughs> yeah, so did I. Yeah. Oh, elbow. Sorry. Talking to the mic more. I am. You're not, you get you were like really loud before, and then you just get like really like shy. Because I know there's people listening to me, and it's kind of scary. You Fifty-five know? subscribers. Woohoo! Forty-five more to big time. <laughs> okay, chill. I really can't break this off. Can you do it? You talk to me. I've broken like one thing. Um. Okay. So. Oh, Oh, what the hell? Um, Trailers, they happened. Well, they happened ages ago. Uh, How long ago was Super Bowl? You don't know. Um, there was a lot of trailers because that's the what first they do. Super Bowl day was Sunday, but Monday for us. Mm-hmm. Someone... Do you watch oh, American football? Why not? Because it's not entertaining. Are you I'll sure? It. I like American football. Plus, it's on in the morning, like early hours of the morning. Does if you record it and then watch it in the but you can't record it because you, you don't can. get it on TV. You can. It's in Sky. Is it? Oh! Hello! Oh, we've been that. <laughs> Good thing you don't need that bit. Yeah, we need that bit and I don't that bit. Right. One. We should have a guest on here. We should. Well, we had, oh, we went out. Okay, so we went out for Connor's birthday. You did. I did not. Yeah, because well, yeah, you're not old enough. And we... Not my friend, that's <laughs> We met like loads of people that wanted to listen, that like, wanted to come on the podcast. Oh, okay. And why did you want to do this? Oh, we're gonna have to put a picture of how this ends. <laughs> That's gonna be fun. It is. Me yeah, and uh, we got a couple of well, Connor forced his mates to subscribe. Because That's it was his birthday, so he just grabbed their phones and went, You're now subscribed, you're now subscribed. And then we put, That's how we passed 50. So big up, thank you. Next step 100. Ruby's recording us onto Snapchat. Hello, people. That was just your forehead. I don't know. Why? <gasps> there it is, Ruby. There it is. There it is. We've got that one. Okay, so that's piece one. Oh, it fell out. <laughs> Why are you doing this? What? This is horrible. Why would, you don't have to do that then. Okay, well, the tabs won't stay in. I don't know. This is just, this is horrible, this is. Um, Can you tweeze him? You've got to push him down. Yeah, and there was a guy who'd been on Celebrity Dinner Day. Are you aware of this show? Yeah. We, like, they go out with celebrities, and this guy apparently had been on a date with Jess Wright. Don't, isn't it where, like, they go to their houses and they, the person cooks dinner? I think so. And then, it's on Channel 5 or something, isn't it? And then they get, if they, like, if they like them, then they go back to the house. If not, they get a ready meal for one or something. <laughs> I need tweezers. Because I need to bend round, like, I need to bend it. I'm just going to do it with my nail, it's going to hurt a lot. Oh well. Oh well, look, we haven't even gotten to this part yet. Jesus. Um, there we go, did it. Congratulations. So that's piece one. Let's take a break. Um, I just sipped it. Yeah, and he, sipped and he was basically like, just talking about. There was a good, like, tw- good, like, ten odd people, like, we were just talking about Avengers Infinity War and stuff like that. Yes. Just like, how do you think Endgame's gonna go? It's like, blah. And he like was talking about this Punisher 
comic book that he read, the way he gets like War Machine's armor and stuff, and was like, I want to come on the podcast. Cute. And we were like, yeah, man, loads of people. So, um, shout out to the people, Matt. I mean, my friends are probably going to come Yeah, well, we're getting another mic. Um, I'm ordering one tomorrow. I New one. Well, Matt's got a camera because, oh, yeah. Um, oh, hello. Hello, love. Any of those who follow on social media. We was filming a, a little vid yesterday, an actual live action. See the face of someone. Not me. Stay tuned. You, Ruby wasn't in it. Ruby will be in one soon. What is that? What's that? That is number two. Um, Do I have Ruby? No, it's just that's the number two. Um, it should be around here. I think it's this. This. That does not sound good. Is it not that bit? What bit? This bit. That? Is it that? No, look. Two is this. Look, right here. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, there you go. Look, so this is the numbers on there. Huh? Yeah. It says numbers on there. You read that. Two, 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 two. Okay, uh, yeah, so anyway, oh, I'm waffling. Trying to fill time. Connor's ill. That's where he is. So he's been. Saw Lego movie and then he's died. But he'll come back. Um, as well, someone else. Matt is coming back. We don't know where. We don't yes. know when. But hopefully it means some production values added to this thing. Look who's there. So they found it. That's cool. I feel like we should have like videoed this. But alas, it is too late. Mm -hmm. You've lost that's your 14. bearings. That's fourteen. That's not. That's not. So did you see? One. Going back to the Super Bowl. Did you see the Avengers trailer? You didn't see the Avengers trailer. No. Why not? So basically, um, it was this TV spot that was um, Cap, very much the focus, saying, you know, some people move on, but not us. Giving shots of the original corporate Avengers rocket, different locations, looking like the barn cool. from the end of Infinity War. Uh -huh. And what looked like a person had been edited out of a group shot. Uh, Captain Marvel, a lot of people are debating because there's a big space where someone should be. But yes. we'll find out in due course. Are you kidding me? What? I've got to get that little thing and wrap it all the way around then and put that on top. It's going to take me ages. Where's number four? Okay. You just talk. Yeah. Let me see if my friend's touch at any background. I'm just going to get my hooks then. Um, yeah, so um, that was a good one. That was. Okay. Yeah, intense because how do you how are we gonna do? Been? Yeah, good. Work. Tired. <laughs> Valentine's Day today. I'm just. Where? Let me see the way. Oh, the way. Oh, yeah, anyway. Oh, I'm trying to remember the super. There was a Hobbs and Shaw one, the Fast and Furious spin-off. Oh, hello. Yeah, I know. Um, no, Jason no. Statham and The Rock teaming up and having fun and kicking it out. Oh, you see that thing where it's like when. Um, that a great moment when the rock and Dwayne Johnson first met. Have you mentioned that before? Maybe, but I don't remember. Maybe, but you don't remember. Yes. Someone paid money to get their money to. Someone paid their money to money. Someone paid their money to get their makeup that like Frida, right? And they ended up looking like this person from Shrek. It's really funny. Who is it, Lord Farquaad? No, that one of those ugly stepsisters. Oh, then Dor ones. Doris or something. <laughs> That's her name, but she's really ugly. Yeah, the, the one that's a man? Yeah, it has the plaits at the front of her head. Uh, that go up. I cannot get this out, because I do not have small fingers. Can you do that? Yeah, that one. Give it a... Let me see what life's about. Go. Oh, yeah, Watch Shane sure. Dawson's video came out. Oh, Monday. yeah, you like conspiracy Day. showing. What am, I what am I aiming for? That one, the one that I like bent. Oh, shit. It won't come out, because I can't... Yeah. When are we giving up and throwing this away? Not for a while. Needle nose pliers are helpful for assembly. Well, then why don't you put them in the pack? Anyway, yeah, that came up Monday. If you've seen that, then tell us, because it's good. Well, I haven't actually watched it all yet, but the first one was good, like, really good. kind of scares me, though, when I watch it, and I have to watch, like, happy stuff after it, because it scares me. I scared you. Weird, it's it's fucking weird. It's not that weird. It's quite cool, actually. It is when it's like, hello, it's my mom. Cool. And then they're like, oh, did you just say it's my mom? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, what? 
Mm. Oh, no, it's still weird. But cool. Mm. That doesn't sound good. Oh. Oh, that. Sorry, Siri. I mean. <laughs> This new phone I does hate... not like me. Oh yeah, you got a new phone! Yeah, oh sh... <laughs> Why did I say that? Oh, I got my upgrade, so now I have an XR. It's massive. Um, I'm Look at that. Confused. It's like... Look at that. Look at that, yeah, they, they like can't see it. Yeah, they can see it. Uh, well, they know what it looks like. Got my case, so if I drop it, hopefully it's fine. Oh, hello. Come in. You saw the Frozen 2 trailer. Yeah, I totally did. What happens in it? The like Elsa's walking over like the sea, and she's like shooting her powers, and she's like walking over ice, and then she's like running because it all like crumbles, and then she gets under a wave, and then Kristoff's like on sand, and then he's like going with like loads of other reindeers. Then Arnold like they find like a new place. Do you know what I really hope happens? They find their parents, mm -hmm. and they find Tarzan as well because there's like a conspiracy where Tarzan is their brother because their parents got killed by like a wave and then got washed up and had his toes on. Oh, okay. Okay, please Ben. So yeah, I think it's going to be cool. Are you going to watch it? Because I am. Frozen 2, I don't know, maybe. I mean, you I have an unlimited card, you might as well. I know, I do have an unlimited card really. And do you know what I recommend seeing with an unlimited card? Everything. Elite Battle Angel, because if you're paying for that, fucking hell, you're an idiot. So, Elite Battle Angel is a film made by people. Well done! Um, it produced by James Cameron, you know, the man famous for shitting on his own franchises. Um, <laughs> Avatar, Titanic. Ooh, Avatar, they're making like, loads of Avatars, aren't they? Yeah. They made that it's like another three. They made that thing about that, like, alien girl or something, whatever. It's made by the same people as Avatar. That's what Lucy was talking about last time, but she didn't understand what it was. So yeah, yeah, it was Elite. Yeah, that one. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, oh. <laughs> Elite Battle Angel. So it's been apparently been in production for years. It looks really bad. Is it bad? The C no, the CGI is great. I don't... Yeah, have I spoken about it? I don't remember if I've spoken about it because I don't remember when I saw it because everything's just a blur. But... Neither. Um, so, the story of Elite Battle Angel is that... Of, there, it starts with a man, Christoph Waltz, who is um, Dr. Dyson... Edo, um, who's a mechanic, he's a mechanical engineering doctor thing man, uh -huh. finds a, no. I was... finds the core of a cyborg, like half head, um, like it's like fleshy, um, finds that the brain is still pulsating, but it's still alive, but the, and then he also finds that, um, oh, no. Go ahead. Go ahead. He, he takes it back to his laboratory, um, Attaches it to a body. The body um, wakes up, or well, she wakes up, and um, Baby, oh, discovers sorry. that you know the body was meant for his daughter, who was disabled. But I think that comes later. Um, so hard to remember this movie. Um, she eats an orange with the Ooh. peel on. Don't think you'd like that. You're allergic to them. Um. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> he. He names her Alita after his late daughter. Um, starts looking after oh my her, God. having her like his assistant. Can I tweet this? In here? Yeah. I don't know. Um, no. Not in this room, I don't. Are you all asleep? Yeah. Hello. Hello. Um, then she, yeah. So, uh, and she's like a teenager. She like meets a boy that she fancies, who's fine. Like he Can rides a futuristic motorcycle. So basically, there was an event called the Fall. There was like an intergalactic war, and there was like cities in the sky. And the Fall was like the fall of all the cities except the last one, which um, the name of which escapes me because I was forgetting the film as I watched it because the film felt a lot longer than it was. Um, and so the people that they live on the ground, you're not allowed to go back up, it's only the privileged. Or the people that win this thing, I think it's called motorball. Where it's like basically skating, getting a ball and then putting it in a basket. But like, it's extreme. Looks a lot like Spy Kids 3, but that's probably because the director of Spy Kids is the one who did this. Spy Kids? Oh, that kid's yes. Spy Kids, what am I 
our Juni Cortez. Yes, the ginger one. This is the thickness of everything. I'm not even done with step three yet. <gasps> I don't know. I don't know what else is going on this week. Um. Yeah, and then Rose body. She like learns. She becomes more personified. Makes friends. Um. Keeps having flashbacks to her old life. That's sad. Which was as. A warrior from the Mar she was like one of the Martian like she was the invading forces and it draws her to this body that she finds in a crashed Mars spaceship oh. that oh, she then it's attached to after she because there's these people like hunter hunt killers that um hunt down people that are wanted for money yeah, same. and then they get loads of credits and yeah. stuff like that. Hello, hello. But, um, yes, it all goes a bit skew with because she gets cut up into loads of pieces by, um, yeah. oh, what's his name? Um, a later battle angel on the gurgle. That's all, folks. Um, Sixteen minutes of recording, that's it. Please. Um, cast, fuck. Uh, Excuse me. Garishka is like, because there's loads of cyborgs, like people are, you don't really die in this world, like if you get injured you can just like attach yourself to robot parts, like, and yes, so he's, Garishka is one of the big bads who cuts her up into loads of pieces, um, um, which then she puts on the Mars, gets put in the Mars body which transforms to, uh, oh my god, oh my god no, I'm gonna break it, <gasps> no. Okay. What was that? Well, I have no idea what that was. Um, future. Um, da, da, da. One. So she does that hunts things. Um, every time she's in a like, near death scenario, she okay. becomes memory. She has memory of past life. So close. So she has to. She needs to, she needs to keep putting herself in danger to to basically remember what she was like. I think. It's so hard to remember this. Um, God's sake. Uh, stuff happens, her boyfriend gets killed off twice. Eh? And gets stabbed by um that makes it's Erkin from Deadpool is like one of the big like hunt like big assassin villains and he's funny and he, like he stabs him through the chest and then uh, so then she cuts his head off to connect it to her heart to keep him alive and put him in a robot body. And then when he tries to ascend to the Iron City, it's he gets sliced up and then falls again. It's weird because this film just like starts, stops, like it builds towards one thing and then stops and then goes back and then builds again and then you don't really know when it could have ended like four or five times. And but you'll never know. Well, you will never know. Well, you will because they want to do like because basically it's sequel bait because it's based off of the um off of a manga series and it feels. Festival manga series, really? Yeah, and it, it basically is, I don't remember, it's called like Gun something. I um, And he, yeah, it like ends on, ends on a cliffhanger with her, then spending, it like jumps months forward of her like in the battle, in in the motorball like thing, she's built her way up well, that's to dumb, the top that's the, the champion. Much. And then it's her point to the sky. There's because there's an overarching villain called Nova, who possesses people. We don't know how, we don't know why, and he he possesses. There's um, Mashala A from um, Luke Cage, is is good as oh, what? What was his name? Name that character. Name that character. Um, there's Vector and Vector. Vector Vector who like runs the the motorball Not Vector, the motorball right. industry and is secretly you know there's put there's um oh, souls wow. being hunted and dismantled and then you know they've got plans. Christoph Waltz deserved better in this movie. <laughs> His ex wife Jennifer played by Jennifer Connolly. Um 
she's there. They moan about their daughter that they had who was killed by, a, you know, a drunken cyborg that was looking for drugs. Uh, that that was that Sounds happens. Um, it's just like the bits of the thing drag on. The action set pieces are good. Oh mm. shit! Oh, That's a good thing I've got the case on. Um, and like the movie looks great, it just doesn't feel it because <laughs> it just takes so long to do anything. <laughs> and then by like by the time you've got to a good action set piece, like, you've for sat for through bit. like. 40 odd minutes of just boring like talking like the, it skips so many things you don't know when it's meant to be you don't know how they've sort of assumed this relationship and then kind of fun yeah I don't really know what to say like it's a film that I don't think you have to b see it to believe it seeing is believing oh my god I put it the wrong way I'm not moving it oh, actually not going on the right way what am I um and yeah, go see it if you have an unlimited, unlimited card. If not, or don't pay like, for it. Or an Odin Limitless, like something like that. Six Just don't pay for it. <laughs> but Six. it's one of them things that you'd like you'd stick on, on Netflix in a few years' time. Just be like, Oh, that was that thing. Or that movie. Yeah. It looks it looks great. I'm not sure about the story. That's what I would say. About a leader paddle angel. Maybe if I had to give it a rating, maybe like a four. Mm. It's because it just feels four out long. Of ten. Yeah. Because it feels long. No, it's four out of ten. Everything is out of ten. Everything is fine. That, that is coming later. That's uh, horrible. So, excuse me, I am so terribly sorry, old chap. Oh, well. How's the Millennium Falcon going, Rib? Update. I'm on steps. You'd expect it to be really further than it is, but it's not. No, no. there are a lot of pieces left. Um, if anyone's wondering, it's basically like a, like a metal, like a metal, pla metal uh, 3D model kit of the Millennium. So like, think like an Airfix model, but no glue and painting involved. You literally just have to put the tabs in and fold them. And they're metal. Yeah. And it hurts. And it's been really tiny and really like fiddly. And Ruby's just been determined to do this for ages. So let's let her have her fun. <laughs> it's my fun. It's my jam. I ate some bananas. B A N A N A S. Mmm. Banana. You don't like bananas, do you? I hate bananas. I don't like. I don't mind banana like scented things unless they're really strong and fake. But I hate the texture of banana. Like, who invented it? <laughs> like, who? God, if you're listening, please. Make them have a better whoever, whoever did the banana thing. Start up. Oh my god, I had a really nice vegan brownie kit. Oh my god, it was so nice. Why did you eat a vegan brownie? Because there was a bake sale at school and there was, I couldn't be able to go to the other side where the other stuff was, but it was chocolate and it was like, mm, it's like this is okay. Mm hmm. Well, well, why was there, was there a vegan brownie? Because the person made it was vegan. Oh, selfish. No, it's not selfish. Yeah, for I'm doing that for my GCSE um, exam. Oh yeah. Is vegan. How's that going? <laughs> okay. First of all, I'm not doing any enough stuff that's technical because I mean, someone made like um, homemade like chicken, sweet and sour chicken, and I made bread roll. <laughs> so that's fun. But I will do better. You learn by doing, didn't you? Yeah. In the real thing, I want to make like really cool stuff. I hope you can do it. Like what? Um, some vegan meringues mm. with um, a fruit compote and like honeycomb, mm -hmm. um, a hummus pizza, and either I'm either gonna do a stir fry of marinade tofu with my homemade noodles or something else. I don't really know. Don't really know. But I got six out of six on section A for the project. So. Well, that's good. Yeah. I, I see. I don't know how the numbers work anymore. I can match that. It was letters. Yep, but now we have numbers one to nine. What? Why? Because the people. That's how they want it. Yeah, it's really rubbish because I don't get it. It's like one is like a well, obviously you don't pass if you get a one. So pass is like a four. If you want to do it at a six form, you basically have to get a four or five. So five is a C, and then six is B. Seven is that A? Eight. 
Is it A star? No, is it A star star? That's how they're saying it is, but mm -hmm. I don't really know, to be honest. It's so mm. basically the best you can get is a nine. You can't get over a nine. In my business test, I got an eight. Whoa. Why? So what was that equate to an A? A star. Well, what's a nine then? A star star. Ah. Oh. I didn't realise they were real. But why are you so quiet, bro? Because I'm trying to do this. Trying to do this, bro. I did it. Hold on. Oh, no, I didn't. That one's like, oh, for God's sake. Oh, for God's sake. Do you want me to talk about Lego Movie 2 while you're doing that? Sure. Okay. Because I don't read it. You're a fan of Lego. Yeah, I have Lego Movie 1. You bought it for me. Actually, you bought it on Blu-ray, which you can't watch on my TV. So you basically bought it for yourself. Anyway, go <laughs> Yeah, I know, that was your plan the whole time. No, because I'm just going to buy it on 4K. Yeah, but then I can't, still can't watch the other one. Yeah, just get a Blu-ray player. Or just use one of the consoles in your room. One console? Yeah, one console. No, like, as in use one of them. Like, one of the many that we own as a collective. Well, you own. I, mean, mm. I don't even own any of them. Technically, one's, like, half mine, which is the one that's in my room, but you don't want it anyway, so... Technically, no. Yeah, I want that. I want the 360. No! You've you can have everything. my you can have my old one. So you can, I'll have the three sixty. Your old one. So you'd rather have a three sixty than a one. Got a one X. That's fine. I just sometimes need to use it. But um, I'll have the one then. Um, basically, Lego Movie mm -hmm. Two, the second part, um, is kind of a twenty nineteen animated motion oh, picture. That That's why it's not going in. No. From the Warner Brothers Animation Group, um, it's a follow-up to 2014's The Lego Movie. How it was 2014. Yeah. No you, way. How did you? Uh, what are your opinions on the Lego Movie? How many times did I watch it? Like three times in the cinema. It was really good. I loved it. Mm -hmm. I you... mean, I was eleven. Eleven. Yeah. Eleven. I was eleven, so I really liked it. Eleven, probably twelve. Oh yeah, probably twelve actually. Yeah. I first watched it on the plane to Mexico. That's Maybe I did. That's the first time I watched it. It was only that 13 hour flight and I was like, oh my god, Lego moves on it. Oh yeah, I think I did the same. I watched it and I was like, wow. I watched so much stuff on that flight, it was such a good flight. I watched that, I watched Captain America and Soldier. Oh, I watched that as well because she told me to watch it. Yeah, which is weird because you wouldn't, that was like, when you were younger you weren't sort of really sort of... Yeah, but you told me to watch it, so I watched it, I was kind of bored though. I listened to a lot of music. They had some TV shows on there as well, didn't they? I don't really remember. Oh, I, I watched, remember Lego Movie. I think I watched the My Little Pony movie. Don't joke. I remember Lego Movie. I remember Winter Soldier. Well, Winter Soldier was so sick. They had like old films on there. Mm. They had like loads. They had a big range. Oh, I don't yeah. remember who we flew with. Virgin. Did we? Yes. Oh, yeah. Because I got that like, shout out. Virgin kids. Oh, the bag thing. thing. Yeah. Yeah. I got one of them on the way to America. Like years ago. I don't know if you existed. Old. I was six months old. Huh? No, but I don't know if it was before that because I went a few times. You know, sometimes when you didn't exist. Did you go to Florida twice and then Florida twice? Once, once, once you were there and I slapped you in the head. Oh yeah, you were mean to me. Well, yeah. you're, you're still mean to me. But, yeah. but now you're like mean bigger than me and stronger than me, so you can just beat the crap out of me. Um, basically. basically, yes. Anyway, yeah. So Lego Movie, I'm fantastic. It's still like because that sort of didn't. No one really expected that to go anywhere. Like that was just like. It just surprised everyone, yeah. like how good it actually was. Like me included, I was like, "Oh, this is pretty sick, bro." And they did um, did you see Lego Batman movie? No. Did it? Sorry. Lego Batman movie, which was great. Yeah, I still haven't watched that. One. Lego Ninjago as well, which was good. I haven't seen that. I don't want to see that. No, I like that. it's the weakest one, but it's. I think it's just because it come the out. Weakest link. But it's just because it come out the same year as Lego Batman movie, it's a bit of overkill. You know, this is the, f like, Lego Movie 2 is the fourth Lego movie. And there is more to come. So I it's get, it's picks up right at the end of the uh, first film with the invasion of the Duplo bricks. Because um, the dad allows the sister to come and play. And so it's then the sister's toys. And then it cuts to five years later, which has then Apocalypse Berg. Isn't the dad like the one that wants to like glue all the things down or something? Yeah, but then that's how we um Will Ferrell. Yeah, Will Ferrell and like glues everything down and he sort of makes like uh 
It, it makes like brief appearances because like it cuts straight into Lego World of the boys, boy and the girl playing for it. Can you guys it to Fee's parents? What's the main guy? Um, Emmett, played by Chris Pratt. So yeah, Pigs Up Five is like this now apocalypse mode because everything's been destroyed by the great Duplo bricks. Emmett's still as happy as can be. There's a nice little remix of Everything Is Awesome oh, called cool. the Teen Dream Remix because five years older and it's actually. The same boy is five years older. The sister's older, and you see, and you see how their relationship has developed. I need huge scissors. And um, oh, I just hit the mic. Chuck the mic. Chuck the mic. Chuck the mic. Chuck the mic. What? You got no love in your bed, the mom. Yeah, um, yeah. Yeah, and Emmett um still is like everyone's got got really gritty and grown up because it's like basically like almost a metaphor for puberty, like. No, it's all grown up now, this is what we do. Uh, and they keep making jokes about it, like, you know, this is so grown up, this is what we do. Um, well, because like, he won't play with them if he's grown up. Then. No, like, he plays with them, but, like, in a different way. Like, he doesn't, it's not all, like, happy things. It's, it's like, like uh, gritty, like, dark apocalypse, like, very Mad max S kind of world. Um, and then... Yeah, you, there's an invasion... Well, like, a, a ship comes down, which is part of the Lego Friends range. I love Lego Friends. I had so many sets. They're, like, weird, thin things that you can only sort of, like, move. Like, you can only articulate, like, the middle of the body. Have you given up? No. No, you just have a break. Have a kick. Oh, she's in two vi That's so weird. Like, why is her name on there twice? Wow. That's really weird. Wow. Wow. Jimmy hasn't fixed me. I wonder if her finger is weird. Wow. I'm sure she's fine. Um, gets invaded and then captures the fiercest leaders, which is um, Lucy Wild style, uh, Batman. Um, oh, what's the pirate's name? Metalbeard, um, Benny the spaceship guy, and Unikitty. Oh, Unikitty is my favourite. To take them to the Sistar system. Sistar. Which is um, they make joke like they made jokes about the void and stuff like that. It's they, it's the um the stair gate, and they have to go through that to the sister's room, which is where she's got her world, which has, you know, the Justice League had gone to fight off um, the sister system. And um, then Emmett decides to show that he's grown up enough and that he's tough enough to go and try and rescue them, builds a spaceship to follow oh. them, ends up in the... Is that the wrong way around? No. And it ends up in, you know, the space between the stairs and the bedroom and get saved by Rex Danger Vest, also voiced by Chris Pratt, who's like a cool person that Emmett wants to be. And Is that Piggy's boyfriend? No, Emmett's Wild Style's boyfriend. What now? Yeah, so um Oh yeah Batman used to be a boyfriend. Yeah. He's like yeah, he's like it's so cool. And yeah, because there's loads of jokes about um Obviously, Batman had his own movie, and they, they make a joke about that when the Justice League go and fight him because they take um, Jason Momoa's Aquaman, voiced by Momoa, and they're like, "Where's Batman?" It's like he's having his own independent adventure, um, and the Justice League get lost up there, and all the things people from the world have been lost, assumed dead or missing, and and it has dreams about um, Armageddon, where the um, the ground all cave in and everyone will put into the uh, bin of storage. <laughs> oh my god, that's so funny. And it's, there's another catchy song um, called The Catchy Song. Oh. Which is um, used because um, the, the Sistar system is really big into upbeat pop tunes, sometimes for torture, sometimes for brainwashing. And um, the lyrics are, this one's going to get stuck inside your head. And it does, it's very upbeat and catchy. And Just like God him. bloody damn it, uh, Emmett does things. Um, him and Rex become friends. He has a spaceship full of dinosaurs and like to get him to his friends and they make plans to, you know, uh, make plans to get his friends back, destroy the world that um, that is holding them hostage because they think the Queen is trying to marry the queen is trying to marry batman what to unite the worlds the uh, queen um whatever one tanabi 
and she is yeah so she's trying to say to unite the world she is now even has a song about um not being sinister which um whilst i goes well this is obviously you know the opposite of what you're trying to say um uh they think it's to brainwash and to cause Armageddon. Turns out she's actually good. Because she's a good one. Yeah. She's a good one, that one. And she Excuse me. Um Batman flosses while dressed in some kind of weird Liberace get up where he's like glittery and all that. And then he he's like, Don't worry, the song is not affecting me at all. They're all invited to the Sistar system for the matrimony ceremony, which turns out to be um, the, there's a heart that Emmett builds for the Duplo invasion, like originally back at the film, like to show like peace among worlds that gets eaten. But that is what um, Queen whatever uh, what Watanabe is, excuse me, because that was a sit like it looks like the symbol of the brother. Saying that it's okay to play with the sister, but then he keeps like pushing back against every time she tries to play because she keeps destroying everything. Cause kind obviously... of like Toy Story when Thingy yeah. destroys the thing. Yeah, because obviously she's younger, doesn't know I'd how to play. Human, yeah, probably. And she she says like, I just wanted to, I just wanted you to play with me. Oh, thank you. And it accidentally causes the arm Armageddon by <laughs> destroying, causing. It to be destroyed. Well, so I'm the mom, the story. I'm not going to want to see it though. The mum and yeah, but like, it's fine. It's still a good movie. Oh, I still want to see it again. Tells whatever. Uh, yeah, so she tells them to put them into the storage bin. But they learn to be friends and get along, and it's a jolly good fun oh, time. Me, All right, I will. Oh, and yeah. then. Uh, oh, that, wait, which way did we go? Oh, that way. Go away, Siri. And. Oh, that's what I wanted to say, what? Nice. Marlene. Well, I literally tried to save my life. I did not have small enough fingers for this. Look, I have to curve it round to put the That is tab unbelievably in. small tabs. Uh, and it, I can't even it, see this. Why don't I put my glasses on? Does the thing. Uh, they're put in as a storage bin, but they learn to play together. Um, meaning that they then collide their worlds, and it's like grown up, but like for kids, and it's fun. And they all get along, everyone's rescued. How old's the kid now? Uh, well, it's five years, so. <gasps> yeah, I'm I gonna do say. That. Teens, so maybe like 14? I mean, I wouldn't be playing with Lego, but you know. 14 is the older one, and then the sister. 14, and then it's actually the same kid that played him in the first film. What about me playing with Will, Lego years ago? Will Ferrell. Just has like. All the returning cast are great. Will Ferrell has a bit of a guest thing, like he appears at the beginning and appears at the end. Yes. Open what? Uh, I don't open Grandad's messages live. That's suicide. All the returning cast are great. The only person that doesn't return is um, oh, fucking Morgan Freeman, who was. Who was it? Who was it? Morgan Freeman. Andy Dufresne. He was uh, Petruvius, the uh, wizard, the blind wizard oh, in the first yeah. one. Oh, he's sort of, yeah, because obviously he died, so he's not in it. Morgan Freeman? No, not Morgan Freeman, like the character died, because like, he's a ghost on the string, isn't he? You've got to put that tab in. Oh, wait a minute. Because um, he's like a ghost on the string, isn't he? Like, and then gets think, because he's at the beginning when they do the Duplo bit, and then gets sort of like knocked out of the way, and then he's gone. Um, And yeah, uh, Chris Pratt's great. Chris Pratt voices two people, so he gets like to play off of himself. But you, oh yeah, and also because obviously the Queen's then revealed not to be the evil one. Rex Danger Vest is the villain, but um, dun dun dun, because it turns out he is Emmett from the future. Yeah, old child. Because when he originally journeyed upstairs, his spaceship crashed, and he ended up on the um in the under dryer system. Um got learnt to you know be tough and gritty and grown up because he was on his own and his friends didn't come for him and then he steals um he demolishes doc brown's De um, delorean doctor who's tardis bill and ted's um phone booth and kind of whatever skynet we're using and to build his um time traveling spaceship goes back gets the dinosaurs as a crew 
And then, uh, oh my God. Oh my and then God. tries to make Emmett into him. But, oh, mm. wicked. And, but it doesn't bloody work, does it? Sometimes I've got a bit of French going on. <laughs> you don't know. You don't know. Uh, you don't. But, uh, yes. Yeah. Chris Pratt, um, Charlie Day in the sporting cast, get a lot more to do. Charlie Day as Benny, uh, Nick Offerman as Metalbeard, Elizabeth Banks is Wildstar, and then you obviously got Will Arnett as Batman, back for his third Lego movie. Mm -hmm. And she's obviously got a bit of an advantage. They make jokes about, they make a Marvel joke because when they're in Apocalypse World, they're like, with the Justice League gone, um, and what is it? It's like. <laughs> with, uh, um, Justice League are missing, Batman's now gone, and with Marvel not returning our calls, <laughs> because obviously DC is owned by Warner Brothers, so they can use them, but you know, that's the joke that, you know, the rival company. They're like, all we're left with is original Aquaman and unlicensed spin off property Larry Poppins. There's a guy in the top hat that goes, I think a spoonful of salt will help the medicine go down. <laughs> and they're like, oh, shut up. But um, yeah, it's a very, it's, it's a very fun. It is true, very fun. I didn't even think of that because Disney owned Mary Poppins as well, didn't they? So that's why Warner Brothers wouldn't be able to use certain people. Mm -hmm. You know, Disney mergers taking over the world. They're gonna, you know, ruin us all one day. Yes, we're all gonna get killed by conglomerates. Anyway, um, What's that? fantastic film. Bloody good Rating. laugh. I would say it's on, for me, it's on par with the first one. It's not... 10 out of 10? I'd give it a solid 8 out of 10. Great story, a lot of fun. I like, they, there's a lot of singing in it. There's a lot of musical numbers, which sort of seems a bit weird, but then they sort of kind take of they thing. take the mick out of it for doing so. Like that, goes, oh great, singing again. <laughs> Strap in, everybody. <laughs> oh, and like, the oh, musical, yep, everyone get ready. They're going to start singing. Ugh. It's a lot of fun. You'll love it when you get around to seeing it. And I can't bloody wait. Just, I think they, you've got to kind of do a third one, maybe, wrap, to wrap it up. It's almost like, for me, it feels like this generation's Toy Story. Like playing with toys and ageing and coming to terms with your life and angst and growing up and such for... I used to love playing with that toy for Lego. We yeah. used to build the train from Toy Story 3 out of Lego. Did we? Yeah, the train track. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, yeah, I would fully recommend Lego Movie. I wouldn't recommend Lita. That's that. Have That's you got have you got anything? Rubus? Rubus Maximus? No, Petrus Dextrus? I'm just excited that the Dorian Trinity is going to come back. Who? The Dorian Trinity. Cool. Can you speak louder, please? No. Why? You were fine earlier. You were actually going into it. And you're... <coughs> <laughs> the Dorian Trinity videos are coming back. If you don't know who they are, then Google them. Okay, what do they do? videos and uh, challenges and tanks and stuff like that but they're nice people but they look sad out so they have oh. been on YouTube but they're coming back next oh next what's it called um week <laughs> next Tuesday because they always um put their videos up on Tuesdays yeah and they were filming with Jeffrey Star yes. Jeffrey Day. Yes. So maybe it's with Jeffrey Star because I love Jeffrey Star. Cool. Any other, you know, YouTube you don't stuff like that you want to... No, wanna... you don't even know Jeffrey Star. No. I don't know. Who do I watch? I like, um, these... They're like mainly in England. Danby Girls, they're good. What they do they do? challenges all together with their family. They do, like, assumptions. They do family mukbangs or mukbangs, whatever you want to say. However you guys say that. And they do like, yeah, they just do stuff like that. They're actually really funny. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Uh -huh. VidCon this weekend. Is it? Who's a VidCon room? What is Vid Wait, What is VidCon? Explain it for the audience. It is like a YouTube convention. If you're in America, it's bigger in America because the VidCon is Amer in America. I think it's in California, but don't hold me to that. And it's like really big and like loads of people go. But the English one isn't as big because obviously we don't have a lot of YouTubers. Here yet. Yet. We'll be there soon, I'm joking. One day. And they, you get to have meetups, they do like live chats on like the stage. 
they um they get sponsored by people mcflurry has been a sponsor for a couple of years mm-hmm. so there's a mcflurry 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 is- band that goes in and you get mcflurry from it obviously they do like merch stands so you can buy like merch there like all stuff like that mm-hmm. and you get to meet your like favorite youtubers yeah uh-huh. not a lot of people going but it's still good but who's the main attractions this year there's Patrick Starr. What Joey's, does he do? He does makeup. He does. He is. Oh my god. I just like you, they're so excited. Yeah, he does really good makeup. Like, he's kind of like. If you like Jeffree Star, you would definitely like Patrick Starr. Because he's like a makeup guru. Kind of like James Charles as well. Are they related? No. Oh. Um, you've got Joey Graceffa. you got um, Elle Mills. Jack Maynard, Saffron Barker, um, and then some people are going but then don't actually have meetups. They just are going to meet their fans but they don't have an actual like, meet and greet thing. Like George Mason, he's really nice. He actually Snapchatted me once. Really? Shout out to George Mason if you're watching, I mean, listening, but you're probably not. Um, Kate Elizabeth's going. She's not uh, an official meet and greet but she's going to just see like fans and stuff. Lizzie Mason's going, which is George's sister. She's going on Sunday, I think. Yeah. I really want to go. I want to meet Saffron Barker because... Yeah. Yeah. What does Saffron Barker do? I know she has a range of, like... Stuff at Primark, yeah. which yeah. Is, like, always sells out. I've said that a lot of it. Which you got for Christmas. Well, not a lot of it. I have some of it. I got the water bottle, the diffuser, the pyjamas. Mm-hmm. It. Last year, I got the pillow, the Just Swing It, like, makeup brush holder. Mm-hmm. And I don't remember. Yeah, she does like loads of stuff. Like her latest video is her um, mum and dad choose an outfit for her for Valentine's Day or something. Mm. But she does loads of stuff. She has like mukbang. She has like her brother. Both of her brothers have like YouTube channels. Like she, she has three brothers, mm-hmm. but two of them do YouTube and stuff. Nice, Casey. His YouTube is Nacy Farm. She, he has a fa- she has a family. He, he has a family. Mm. And she has really nice job vlogs and stuff, you know? And her friend Anastasia. And, oh, Anastasia? Her, Anastasia. Yeah. However you say Anna, whatever. Yeah. Kingsman. She's Saffron's friend and she's like really cool as well. She just moved into a new house and I love moving vlogs because they're like so satisfying. See, like them like tidy their room and like organize it because i love organizing videos my favorite are to watch are, like organizing like someone's makeup because it's so nice mm. to watch yeah what do you watch on youtube me i watch <laughs> pasty shit um mainly the big damn channel with uh, christopher johnson and matthew watson um five who fans before that ended um Rose teeth achievement hunter Bit of fun house, um, clever dick films. I watch his stuff. I watch, um, it's funny just to watch sometimes. Just your know, Thatcher Joe's vlogmas vids. I'm joking now. Yeah, I do watch Joe's those sometimes. Vlogmas. Did he do all them? I mean, like, he missed a good few. There was like a week where he didn't do it. I I, mainly it's like watching them just to see like, what's happening with him and Diane and, everyone, and then yeah. you go in the comments and everyone's like give Diane a YouTube channel like get Diane on YouTube and someone put more Graham content please <laughs> like, big up okay. Graham they're, Graham Swan they're strictly till it ends like a couple of days ago so I don't yeah. know what they're going to do they were actually won sorry if you haven't watched it like you win, on, you win on the tour apparently I mean they both have, they have, he has a glitter ball now What's the point? And he took, you know that picture he took where he's like standing at the bottom of the stairs with her mm-hmm. and she's in that blue dress. The exact same photo but with a glitter ball in his hand. I was like, what? Sorry, who? Well, that's on his Instagram. Yeah, go look on his Instagram. Um, yeah. Yeah. Tell us who you like to watch on YouTube. Maybe we'll find like new people from you guys yeah. in the comments. Yeah. Link like, us up. Open to like new people because sometimes you get bored, don't you? Mm. You like watch, if you like find someone who's really good, I always find like you go back through their videos and watch all of them, but then you have nothing to watch. Mm. It's kind of no, actually on his feed. Yeah, I know. Oh, that yeah. Yeah, 
the exact same footage with the thingy behind. It's a bit weird. Yeah. A lot of people watch different things. Oh well. Yeah, email in. Oh yeah, email as well. Oh, shall I check the emails? Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, go on, I'm gonna love on um, waffle, like fill some void. Waffle, 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 waffle. I mm. love waffles. What was her to talk about today? Yeah, so fill you, go on, fill your time or something, or I'll just log on. Yeah. Um, what's going on lately? Right? Um, I've you... got my GCSE soon. Yeah, how's that? Uh, so, I don't know. School's coming to an end, which feels good and feels like weird at the same time. Yeah, man. Yeah. What are you going to do with your life? I don't know. What do you want to be? I want to be a professional sleeper. It's the one. Now imagine if you like, because you can, you can enter that video at Now TV to get like 35 grand. Like, and you can take a year sabbatical doing, um, watching box sets. That is so cool. You get paid to do so much stuff. I want to be paid to Would you get paid to watch Netflix? Would oh, yeah, that? definitely. I feel like some people would do that to be honest. No, none. Just. No, none. That's kind of. Bastards. Thing. Yeah, I don't know. Um, is there any. I don't know how to respond to that. What? Why does Siri keep going off? No, no, oh, yeah, I'm trying to cut it. I'm trying They're to cut. Yeah, oh, trying to cut down on the old language. Yeah. There's a lot of feedback Same that we're. <laughs> that we're, Not you know. Sure. You know, God, I can't alienate the kiddie, so if you're a child and you're watching this. What are you worry. doing? I'm a child. I'm technically, yeah. not really though. Because technically, like I can, once I'm you're like seventeen, you can basically do like quite a lot, just not drink, because you can go like fifteen. You can get into fifteen. After twenty one, it's all downhill from there. Oh my god, can I read that? Did okay. you see? I didn't finish it. Yeah. So, oh well, yeah. So, um, for anyone who can't see. Obviously, you can't see that. Like, that's that kind of whole point, you know. Yeah. So we did. So I wrote, had to write some scripts for some videos. Wait, you One actually of... did, like? Did you do like sketches? You, you did that's like. That's printed wrong. Um. Yeah. That's oh, it. I get what you're doing. That's quite funny. That's cool. Yeah. So basically, we've got um two videos. But I'm not in it. No. That we're done. One of on. them is a certain returning video. One of them is um, we decided that we need an actual intro video of like what the channel's about. I'm not in it. Well, you, I can write you in that. I could easily write you in that if you want to be in that. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. I'll do that. Um. And. Ba yeah. Basically, what we want to do is you know, it's a lot of fun. I don't really want to give it away because it's kind of fun. Spoilers. Yeah. So it's a. It's you know. It's, stuff is coming soon. Stuff. Yeah. Stuff is coming when you see our faces. There's one where a video that we did the other day. Um. You'll only see a certain person's face because they've been absent for a while and now they have to edit this video. So, you know. So, yeah, it will just be like. Um, We've got like an intro an video. Intro, like, intro, like what the channel's about. Like, this is this is us, but from a different take. No much yet. Um, not not <laughs> yet. Um, loads of stuff we want to do, Jumping. like gaming stuff. I want to, I want to start streaming. There's, we're getting a new, I'm getting a new microphone. Fine. Hopefully, like two more. Because basically, I found like this kit on Amazon. Which is a USB one as well, but it comes with the pop filter and the little foam cover for the microphone. So if we sound different next week, it's because we're slowly upgrading ourselves. Yeah, I want to uh, get the one where you can like, hear it, like the ASMR one. ASMR is so cool. I mean, well, you could do ASMR anyway. Oh uh, yeah, if um, you talk like really quietly. Yeah, so, if you eat something on camera, people like that. It's like. Um, Playing, you don't have not, an ASL voice here. Not yeah. having Ozil in the team is really sort of not helping us. It's like, yeah. Because Arsenal playing right now and we're losing to Baffy Borislov in the Europa League. You haven't League. opened the doctor, sorry. What ones? The ones, the two. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, yeah, I am. Um, completely. I don't know, yeah, completely Tom Baker. I don't know what timeline this is. Um, yeah, completely Tom Baker. When did you get that? Because I opened that for you. Uh, pff, I want to say like a week ago. Oh, okay. So no, that's all done. Website. So now I've just got John Pertry. Billy Hartnell and uh, a Charlton to do. And I'm not currently collecting. Oh, actually, well, I have a Hermione and a Harry. Harry You're sort of going into figure. a pop figure sort I of I have the limited thing. edition Hermione from the one you could only buy like somewhere. Yeah. With the, which they released, but it was literally twenty five pound, which I need to spend money for. Um. So she's sitting on the store and she's got this sorting hat on. She's actually really cool. I have Harry, which I got from 
um, the maker of Harry Potter. Mm -hmm. They have Groot and Davos. So you, you bought me all of them, what? Mm. So I need like a Ron. I really want Ron and then like some others. Mm -hmm. I really want Dobby because the Dobby one is like mini and it's so cute. Yeah. And I want to get a shelf, like you know the Ikea shelves. And then just well, and then have them all on display. Yeah. Oh, I'd love, like, when I that's don't really live, that's like the only thing when I don't live here and I have, you know, space in my room, like yeah, a room where I have space, I want like all that stuff like I'm just I'd ha like have a proper setup for you have, podcasting. You just have an own room. With, That's like, loads yeah. of DVDs in it and loads of like show stuff in it and then like. Oh yeah, podcast. loads of memorabilia and crap like that. Yeah, I'd have like the thing is that the the aim is to like try and move out soon so that then I can have a room in my own place <laughs> with like so basically it'd be like sofa and mics all already set up so then it'd be like come round do the podcast blah blah. Be more relaxed. Yeah, I want to like collect stuff. Like the pop figures are okay, but it's been like really silly. Like the last one I got was Christmas, and the one before that was like. You want to speed, you want to speed yourself up, don't you? Yeah, like I want to get loads of money because there's like a few things I want for my birthday. What do you want for your birthday? Yeah, because your birthday is. I want to. Soon. March. Month. Just over. Your month. your birthday's two days before Mother's Day. Did you know that? Yeah, pancake day is up to the fifth of March. You had pancakes the other day. Was that yeah, for right? breakfast. Yeah. And you want Nutella? Yeah. And I didn't even get any. Because I had to have like. Because basically, have for Christmas, we got like Nutella jars. And I ate, I ate mine and then. Can I say. Well, yeah, you're, and you're our stepsister. Our stepsister. We don't. For, for, yeah. We don't have a consent for name. So okay. Leave it out for now. So, like, she didn't eat all her Nutella. Obviously, I ate mine. You ate yours. Oh, yeah, I'm a chocoholic and I ate mine in a couple of days. So I ate mine, so I had to have the, I don't have diabetes. the fake Nutella. She had the real Nutella and, and you, jelly. you had you peanut butter and jelly. No, because I had marshmallows on mine as well. So I really oh, yeah, because you got a bucket of Harry by marshmallows from Nan. Nanny. Yeah. And then you, um, you had the real Nutella because you bought it because Mum told you I'm in pancakes. But I'm not that upset because. Yeah, well, yeah, but you'll have, some on, you'll have some on pancakes. Yeah, you know, there's big and things. I got a bigger chocolate bar than you for Valentine's Day, so. Yeah. <laughs> you know, you know, bro. You yeah, so I'm not that. Um, anyway, what's it saying? More collecting stuff. Well, the main stuff that I'm collecting is just. I said, I'm going to say what I want for my birthday. Oh yeah, your birthday. Yeah, sorry. I just. There's like a lot of things I want, which I know I'm not going to get all of them because it's like so realistic. So I want a laptop because I'm going into like six form and I need like. A Have you decided laptop. you definitely doing six form? Yeah. Because you were debating that in college for a while. Double. Wasn't? I want to do a double business and psychology. I thought you were doing photography. No. I'm no. getting a lower grade than I need in art, so I'm just going to drop it because I don't really like art at the moment. Okay. Anyway, so I want a laptop. I want a what laptop would you want? Anything, really. Just not like that. Like, not like really <laughs> You're expensive. like anything looking at my Mac. <laughs> not like really expensive and not that like really cheap. Just like something in the middle. Something like mid range. Like something that will actually work, basically. That's it's all just something that does the job. Yeah. Like something that has that like, word and has like the internet. And that's, that'll, be, that'll be me. Not like one of those mini ones that people. Oh, like the notebook. They're horrible. Like the ones that are like half that size. Yeah. Oh, that's the small. That's the small MacBook as well. Yeah, but that's nice. That's like a small size because I want to take it to school. Yeah. But you I do don't so you can school. use it. Yeah, because I can use it at school. You only anyway. want straighteners as well, didn't you? GHDs. GHDs. They're, they're expensive, man. Hundred. The cheapest ones are hundred. Why? It's literally they're like really good. Yeah, but like, well, you, yeah it's and just I, I would straighten my hair. hair every day from sixth form. My hair is so thick. Literally, because the ones I have are like they're like, they're good, but like I need better ones. Mm -hmm. And then I want the Jacqueline Hill X Morphe palette or Times Morphe palette, not not Morphe or anything. The Morphe, the Morphe palette. Morphe, no oh my God, Morphe palette. I wanted the James Charles palette, but it sold out like that. So mm -hmm. you know, You're not getting that. Yeah. The Jacqueline Hill palette is still pretty cool, and it doesn't have as many like bright colours, so I can kind of like, experiment. Mm -hmm. Very yeah. So yeah, they're like the three things I want, and then everything else. If I get money, it'll probably be clothes for six one because I need to have like a specific, not a uniform, but you have to have it in dress codes. So, you know, mm -hmm. you can't wear like really short skirts or like jeans or anything like that. You have to be smart. No, I don't have smart clothes. Wow. So yeah, that's why I want for my birthday. That's well, pretty cool. I don't really if I get anything else. What are you going to get Mum for Mother's oh, Day? Oh, hello, sorry. Oh, I have a cramp, sorry. What are you going to get Mum for Mother's Day? I have a nice, like, recent 
I don't really know. Really I'll do the thing that we normally get her. Okay. Yeah, because we would always get a flower anyway, don't we? Yeah. I'll do that. It really annoyed me that that printed wonky. Oh, why did I do that? Is that our printer? Is that? Yeah. I don't even print stuff on our printer. My laptop doesn't even work. Yeah, because you've got granddad's old one. Yeah. Actually, I just bought my own one. Connor got his on finance. Because I went to, I think I know someone that did that. They like pay like installments a month. I think he's only got like two more installments and then Max paid off. Or it's paid cool. off already. I don't. We were learning about that currently in like um, business, like mortgages and stuff like that. Oh, cool. We never got to learn about that kind of stuff. Learn about inflation. Yeah. The See, they're the kind of things that we economy. need. Like the, the boom, Learning about Brexit. The recession. <laughs> Brexit. Yay. No, really, let's not talk about that. That's your birthday, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, thanks, Hunt. Happy birthday. Yeah, but yeah, and I'm having a party on, on not on my birthday, the day after my birthday. Because my birthday's a Friday, and then the day after I'm having a party. Mm -hmm. What are you doing for if your party? You're, if you're listening, you're invited. Hi. <laughs> I'm going to an Wait, is everyone that's listening room. to this invited? No. You're going to an escape room? Yeah. What is. Oh, well, you know what we need to do? We need to do the Sherlock escape room. Then the Doctor Who one. I did the jail one. You did, you got, did um, the jail one with your father. When I got handcuffed in a jail cell and it was actually scary. Can I've you never done an escape room yet. I've done two. I will be free obviously on my birthday party. Because I did one for my friend's birthday party last year. What one was that? It was about conspiracy theories. You love conspiracy didn't you? Yeah. It was about like a murder and you had to like solve it with all these like conspiracy theory clues. It was actually really good. Mm. And I really excited See, that's the thing, like, I think I'm too... And it has that like, sand in it. It's yeah. about like emperors. Oh, really cool. yeah, ancient Egyptian stuff like that. Yeah. I think I'm too lazy to I work stuff Nando's, out. Sorry. <laughs> Nando's, oh. I love Nando's. And I'm not having a cake, I want Krispy Kreme donuts. Well, you're not a cake person, really. Like, are original glaze, 12 original glaze Krispy Kreme donuts. See, I don't really. What about the chocolate glaze? No. Like chocolate glaze is well nice, especially if you get it warm. I never tried chocolate glaze. No, you're missing out, man. I you don't get, mind You can get cake, it warm one like certain times a day. But I know what I really want to try is ice cream cake. Mhm. Mm or what cakes I really like is the Costco cakes. They're really nice. Like the carrot cake from Costco and the chocolate cake and all that is so nice from Costco. If you have a Costco, because they do Costco in America, right? yeah. yeah. Then go get yourself a cake because it's really nice. Mm -hmm. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me on this one. Trust me on this. Trust me on this. It's so nice. Paint. It? I want to try ice cream cakes. I think it'd be so nice. Would you make it or would you buy it? Buy it. Buy it. I love. I love. Yeah. You love cake. So I'd cake. rather like have donuts and cake because that's like my preferred thing. Yes, it is. And it's probably it's easier to share because if we're all going to be at night. Yeah, you just take you just take a donut. You just take a donut. And it's like, it's not like you have to buy like a cake that's like small, big or large. You just buy 12 donuts, there you mm -hmm. go. Because I don't have that many friends. Yeah, it's a, uh, it's season 7, season 6, season 5, season 4, season 3, season 2. Why are you having two. dot on the there? Season 1. Hmm? I didn't put my book in. It's Valentine's Day. Oh, don't no, know. really? No. I don't know. Um. Anyway, so. I can't believe it's nearly one. It's like literally, but already exactly. Like season today, season today season on Valentine's Day, it's exactly season halfway season through. Season seven. And um, February. So we've got. Oh, because I was. I was anyone who's wondering, I'm just checking because yes. we're doing. Because Game of Thrones starts on the 14th of April. And so I was just What's checking April? the date okay. of like how many episodes we've got left until. Because we're doing every episode up till the first some, episode of season I'm eight. Is gonna be a um, we're gonna look at a season. Um, you've watched be... like season one of no. yeah, you watched season one because you saw Daenerys with the dragons like when they hatched and after she'd been on fire and she was naked. I don't remember. And you're like, was that dad? That was it, dad. And you're like, what is this? <laughs> I did not like that one. I think it's a bit weird. I think you'd get into it. I don't. You're, you're now at that age where you can sort of like watch it. I don't no, watch it a lot. I don't. I don't. I got into like it's Insatiable when it was like first like out on Netflix. It's it's when I had, when it was like December time, and then I watched all of Friday Night Dinner again, and I don't really watch episodes now. I've Friday Night Dinner's coming back soon. I watch Bird Box and stuff like that, obviously. Toast of London's coming back soon. You like Kimmy Schmidt? Oh yeah. You like Titus is your like spirit animal? Oh my god, yes. But I already did something for me. 
<laughs> everyone, all my friends say that. Someone's, they might, one of my friends, right, she, she like sent me all the pictures of Titus and she told me to remake all the poses. I think you should. Have you seen, let me show you which one she sent me. If any, yeah, so anyway, what I was saying is, um, so next week is our last episode where it's not going to be Game of Thrones because then after that we're doing um, an episode each about a season. So that'll be seven seasons covered in seven weeks. That is a lot of pictures of Titus Andromedon. Um, the one with the peacock's going to be hard. We have to choose stuff for our yearbook, and they asked, they were like, so who do you want to meet? And I said Titus, because why not? Because it's Titus. Titus oh, Andromeda. Maybe. The thing about Kimmy Schmidt is like, it gets a lot better as it goes on. Oh, look, look like, who we just talked one. about. Who's that? Daddy, Daddy girls. girls, wow. That's weird. They're, they're listening. Hi. They're doing an ad for Domino's. How did you find um, your episode with Lucy? Good. Because that's like two episodes in a row now that you've been in. And did you feel more at ease with Lucy being here? Easier to talk? No, not really. I yeah. mean, she's, she's alright. She's, <laughs> she's, she's, I mean, she's our cousin. We have to say good things about her, you know. <laughs> I'm joking. Yeah, it's good. I just, I don't... I don't know. With like three people, I feel like we always try to overtake each other. Like when what do you, mean you the- when you like you and Connor do, it, I just feel like oh, there's no point in me talking because like you talk about your separate things that you guys know about. But I don't really know, mm-hmm. and then I just sit there like. Oh. Would it be easier if you had your own mic? Because then at least you'd be picked up, even if you weren't saying a lot. That's Joey. Could I be? Are you wearing any more clothes? clothes? So would you, would it be easier for you if you had a mic each? Yeah. But it's just like, when you're like talking, it's like, oh, I don't really know that, that's some shop would talk about it. Because I don't know about that's a lot you're busy. Things. That's because you're busy at the moment. So. Busy. I'm at school every day. Yeah. You know, bro. I'm busy at school. Oh, Snapchat from Glenda. Oh my god. Did you buy something? No, she, I just put the what she got me on. Um. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> it's Fee's birthday, so I put that on this one. Uh, oh, yeah, your mate's birthday. Um, nearly said his name. <laughs> yeah, no. He, he knows who he is, right? That looks horrible. That looks like a drink and that looks like... Oh, that looks like a trifle. That, are you an idiot? No, I'm not an idiot. Well, some say... Some say. I was going to say my brother said that looks like a trifle, but she won't get it because she's not here, so... Sorry. Everyone's like out on like, dates and stuff. Who's on dates? I think Aries. Oh, that's fun. Do you want me to beat that out? Yeah. Okay. I think my friend, one of my friends is. Mm-hmm. Because look. These trifle. Yeah. It's oh, I didn't read the caption. Oh, but that's why in... I thought you said it, because I thought you were trying to be funny. No, because like, your thumb was in the way of where it said trifle. Oh, so someone like... from my school. Yeah. Are you going to name them as well? <laughs> no. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, they mean that background. Uh huh. Yeah, cool. Everyone's in my outfit look good that day, just saying. Lovely. Have a good outfit. Carry on with the fucking story. We're winding down. Oh, there's like loads of people, like loads. Do your friends listen to this? Some of them. Like who? <laughs> God knows. You should push it on more people. Thingy, you know, um, I can't say their name though, so it's not gonna be. Say well, you've said Javine's name. <laughs> Oh, well done. Say her name again. Well, you've already said it. <laughs> oh, well. I mean, they're not going to care. It's not that I'm saying their last name. Exactly. Um, Today, they're not famous. Becky said she was going to listen to it. Becky's mum. Really? Yeah. Kirsty. I don't know if she's listening to this one, but she listened it's to the just Harry all Bank all you... Really? Yeah. Oh, just because you were in it. <laughs> Is it that what it was? Was... Oh, yeah. Did you just say, like, listen to this one, I'm in this one? I don't know if you mean this or this. Like... Lauren probably doesn't really care. <laughs> That was mood. I don't. I don't think I'd really tell you. You don't really tell you, mate. No, not like all the school mate. I was gonna make my um. Your my... yearbook comment subscribe to Face to Shame. I should have now. I want to go change it or hash brown no filter. Ha- hash brown subscribe. <laughs> hash brown no filter. Subscribe to Face to Shame, which is great. Did you get your yearbook? I don't think I did because I don't remember writing my quote. And I don't. I've I never seen it. I was never witty enough. I wasn't witty enough in school. You weren't cool shy. enough. No, I am now though. Well, not like cool. I'm like nerd cool. Who is the cool people? Show me the cool people. I don't know. There's a picture up there. I'm not gonna point it out and start naming people. Someone. 
Connor's in there. I was supposed to ask you. Yes. Someone has a brother. I think they were in the but I don't remember who it was. So that was really helpful. <laughs> yeah. You can remind me of that off mic. Yeah. Off mic. That's weird. Like you literally left school like in twenty one. Yeah. The Olympics going on. That's crazy. Yeah. We went there's to almost Olympics. Been, there's, there's almost been two Olympics since then. We went to Paralympics and we went to the af- men's athletics final, didn't we? Men's Same for his anniversary games. games. Oh, is that what it was? Mm-hmm. Mine and what was his name? Mine was there. Pokemon, no. Austin, what's his name? The one that got, killed his girlfriend. Oscar Pistorius. Yeah, Oscar. Not Austin. Why is it Austin? Austin. I'm going to attempt the event they joke about Oscar Pistorius, but I'm not going to repeat it. <laughs> Do you actually? Yeah. Lovely. Good old grand grandpa. Grandpa. Does he listen? Oh no, he probably doesn't. I don't think Granddad knows, but I've said Grandad like listen. what I do. All our family shoutouts. Yeah. We're not gonna name all you because there's a lot of you. Nan and Granddad. I showed them it on their TV. Oh yeah, on their TV. Get on TV. That's cool. like go to your apps and then listen to me. And I'm oh like, yeah. Is that you? <laughs> if you live in England, now have a Sky Q box. If you go down to apps, you can actually log in to your YouTube and watch us on the big screen. Well, not watch us, listen to us on the big screen. Watch us soon, though. Yeah. What, Rube, where can they catch us? Go on. You can do the roundup because you do it better. It's Woody's roundup. Mm. It's a That's roundup a copyright. Um, That's not joking. Go on, you're, you're better. You've watched more people do this. Go on. Shall I tell, where where can they find <laughs> us? Ma, ma. On the account. What's that one? Uh, High School Musical. Ma, ma. I really wish I was coming back. Like when every, that thing was flowing around about that fake um, High School Musical 4 trailer, it was, everyone was like, oh my god, it's going to come back. Then everyone was like, oh, it's fake. It's fake. It's fake. It's so fake right now. Okay. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe if you're new here. Comment down below what we comment down below, what who your favourite YouTuber is, because we want to see them. And don't forget to email us if you have any questions or any content you want to see us do. And we'll email us. See, I just said that. Oh yeah, so interrupt me. Socials like uh, Twitter, social, Facebook. Twitter, Facebook. At us on Twitter and Facebook and Instagram at Pacey Sheep. Yes, boy. We will be posting soon because I'm in charge of social media. Well, actually, Instagram because I don't have the other. T- I actually have Twitter. I oh. think. Actually, no, I don't. <laughs> Ruby's yeah. taking charge. I know. You told her I could do the Instagram. Yeah, you could do the Insta. I can't do Facebook. I don't. I don't I've got use loads. Facebook. I've got loads of pictures. And I won't use Twitter because I don't know what how the tweets work. To be honest, but you know, you'll you'll get there. I was like you, um, naive. Yeah. So Big maybe we'll 55. post something today. Oh my god, we should. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah, maybe we will right now. <gasps> oh. You need to log in on the thing. Yeah, I need to remember it first. But while we do that, you can click here for the playlist. So click you can here? start. Why are you Four pointing? Here. There's no camera. In yeah, here. I know. <laughs> if you'll click to your left hand side, we will you have should the put an iCard. Can you put something on the iCard? Probably. Um, um, iCard up here, right here. Okay, she's still pointing, but we'll she's put not. Put the screen. playlist, so you we'll know. Put, on the left, we'll have the 2018 playlist. So listen to us from the beginning, and on the right, the 2019 playlist. If people actually do what they're supposed to do when they're editing. Yes. Hmm. That's me. <laughs> yes, you. I thought Matt was editing it. No, I am in charge now. I am oh, the one. Okay. Oh, I just said his name. Oh, no, Pippa's. What, Matt? Yeah. Oh, everyone, you've mentioned his name before, anyway. Yeah, well, Matt's been on it. <laughs> Matt yeah, used to do this, a long remember? Time ago. We figured out his last episode was, like, number 13. That's crazy. What, what this we is, on, like, this is episode 32. I might took over, basically. I haven't even been in one with him. No. Because that would be in four of us. That's going to be crazy, man. Yeah. What we can talk about, because I don't know. Well one, well, one day it'll be like Rooster. You'll have four people, but you have separate mics, and we'll be on a sofa, and you're going to stop getting cramped one day. But today is not that day. Why do I keep doing it? I just ran. You had a good old rant. I just up, and yeah. you kept on talking, so I'm really annoyed at you. All right, so, sorry. Um, so. You know what to do. This is coming out Sunday. Oh, yeah, we We'll see you next week. See you next week. Ruby, Ruby Bye. might be here. Goodbye, my dear. I have a week off next week, so I'll probably be here. Bye.